Yes, guys, it's the boy Cam, C2B, Cam Talks Boxing. David Benavidez against Caleb Plant. March 25th, Showtime pay-per-view. MGM Las Vegas, bitter rivalry. 50-50 fight, explosive. Someone can get knocked out. Let's talk about it. Yes, guys, let's go straight into it. A great fight in March 2023, March 25th, MGM Las Vegas between David Benavidez and Caleb Plant has been confirmed at £168. What a fight it will be for the interim WBC super middleweight title that is held by David Benavidez. Look, David Benavidez, he's fresh, he's young, he's in his prime quite possibly he's not even in his prime yet so he's 25 years old 23 and 0 26 and 0 with 23 knockouts super power puncher powerful explosive he's got so much speed he throws fast combinations is he a bit is his chin is he a bit open for counters and who look who he's against he's against a counter puncher in Caleb Plant he's got fast hands he can pop now after obviously Getting a new trainer, who's I believe is called Stephen Edwards. Look, Plant's in form now. He's coming off a big win against Darrell. Knockout of the year from Boxing Scene and CBS Sports. He's going to be confident. There's a bitter rivalry between both. They don't like each other. Guys, let me know in the comments. What are your thoughts about this fight getting announced? I think it's great for boxing. You know, there's always negativity about boxing. I know there's fights like Spence Crawford that don't get confirmed. But this fight... It's just super interesting. It's such a it's such a good fight. You can make arguments for both. You can say, look, Benavidez has the has more potential. He could be, you know, the, the guy to you know beat Canelo Alvarez at one six eight. He's the future. <laughs> Benavidez, twenty five years old, but then Caleb Plants, he's in his prime as well. He's thirty years old. He's had a he's had a great. He's got that experience now with Canelo, former world champion as well, IBF world champion. And you could, and you could, and you could argue that you. I think their resumes are similar, but because Plants had that big fight with Canelo, he knows he's used to the crowd now. He's used to that atmosphere, and he's used to you know fighting under the pressure. And look, he did win some rounds against Canelo. He did fight well. And after that knockout, could he be going for a knockout against Benavides as well? We we don't know. We don't know. But guys, like for me, I'm not even going to make a prediction yet. I just wanted to talk about the fight. Um, hats off to both of these guys. Look, well, Benavidez doesn't want to lose his O. Plant didn't have to take this fight. It's a high risk fight. He's coming off a great win. He could, you know, probably could take an easier route to a title. And they're both, they're both shows they're about legacy. They're, they're, they're back their words up. They've had beef over the last few years, back and forth on Twitter. I know they've, like, Plant's called him Fat Boy. Benavidez will reply with his. Fuck with his fat boy with a few up etc. It's it's been crazy. It's been crazy, you know. We both we both wanted this fight, um, and this was a potential fight. This this has been this has been on the horizon, you know. This over the last few years, we always knew this would be a great matchup. So guys, let me know who you who you who are you. Let me know who you are edging for this fight at the moment. And guys, look, I'm going to be talking about this fight a lot more. I believe I'm sure I will be. Uh, during the build up, I'm sure the build up will be heated. Will it be quite? A, will it be quite? Will it be like another scene, like the Canelo and Plant press conference and weigh in and face off? And guys, guys, look, I'm not. I'm not gonna lie. I've had a long day. I'm looking tired. I've been tired, but I just had to make this video. I'm super hyped for this fight. Wow, what a fight, guys! Let me know. Let me know how you feel about this fight. I'll be back with another video.